Hi guys, welcome to the video about Arch Linux Tweak Tool. So, as you see, everything is loading now and uh, changing, so it's variety kicking in. We're talking about XD. These are all installed already. Awesome, BSPWM, ChatWM, i3, LeftWM, Qtile, XFC. Where are they coming from? From the last created package Arch Linux Tweak Tool, right? 250603. So yes, the package will be maintained because I kind of like programming in Python. And I've installed the Tiling Winner Manager. So Awesome has been installed, BSPWM, Budgie is a desktop. Did not install that one, Cinnamon, same thing, desktop. Again, a Tiling Winner Manager, desktop, Tiling Winner Manager, Tiling Winner Manager, desktop, desktop, Tiling Winner Manager, NXFCE. So you know by now, if you watched a few videos that I'm going for XFC and ChatWM, the combination of those two is enough for me as an end user, right? But I, from time to time, as you see, I test, is everything is working and I've improved the code a little bit again this morning. So when we log out, you get choices up here, Qtile, XFC, Wayland. So these are the Wayland things. So beware, sometimes it doesn't work yet. They're working on it. But awesome, let's go have a quick look. And yes, as you see, it has the name Jan. Jan is a, a Dutch word. It's not Jan or something like that. Jan is sometimes for girls, not in Dutch, in Dutch in Belgium. It's actually for a guy. So it's just a um, test for ATT. The last tab you can create a user, right? And of course I need to type the password correctly. All right, and then we have, I don't know if NeoFetch is already installed. Neo, voila, BSPWM. By the way, tip, um, PyCam kit from KLTKOR needs to be rebuilt. It's not rebuilt, it's not working. So you use PyCam these days until it works. Now you've seen this one. So let's go to i3. Again, a typo. I'm so used to typing another password, right? i3. X, log out again. And left WM. <coughs> so if you haven't, if you missed a few videos, let's say it like that. So packages from Arclix moved basically to the Nemesis repo and I've renamed them to edu packages. And if you see this red thing around it, that's left WM, that's loading up all kind of things that needs to be auto started, super shift R. All the knowledge eh, is still valid, of course, everything that we've made in the 5,500 videos on Arclix is still, it's still BSPWM, it's still Plasma, it's still open box, so you check it out. We log out again from here and then we go to Qtile and lastly we'll go and have a look at uh, again typo. We go and have a look at XFCE. All right, Qtile is there. Log out. There's also Qtile Willen, so but you have to take different code for that. Oh my god, I'm really bad at typing Jan. <laughs> And everything starts again, right? How to start. ATT can help you with that actually. Control Alt E, right? Control Alt E, not that password, this password. Um, lets you also delete things in the auto start. This is particularly created for the tiling winner managers. So I don't want Dropbox to start, I don't want Discord to start, I want Variety, don't want InSync, XFC, Short, Telegram, no, right? As simple as that with a click of the button when you log out and log in again then it's not gonna be applied again well the things that I kept on will be applied right so this is still on still on and you get all these things now if you don't like any of these right super simple pseudo pacman minus R remove this Dropbox thing and in sync and so on anything that we have installed no again <laughs> by the end of the video I'll know what to type 
gone right no how to start they, they can leave how to start in there doesn't matter if it's in there if there is no application to start right then nothing will happen so this is the other approach go to the file and say does discord bye bye dropbox bye bye in sync telegram bye bye and keep these two for example another option right so enjoy the att ctrl alt e it's being maintained and please provide um, screenshots for example this are helpful and that's why i made a new version now and it's improved again so because of feedback we can program some things and make this one which i think was a selling point how easy is it to get something on your machine just by a click and install and done log out log in and you've got awesome or any of the other guys all right have fun